this was uh, a good win for Coach Mark. Uh, my mind here. Uh, but I think most, most of the things he's probably impressed with us is that we are improved, you know. He, uh, he loves us, and uh, I just think he's really proud of us and how we improved to um, Joe was saying he was pretty emotional before the game, even more so than usual. Did you tell Vin what it meant to him? Yeah, yeah. Uh, throughout the week, you know, it's just it something different. But uh, what he was just trying to do was just make it better. Uh, we're so thankful for the win, and uh, I hope uh, Coach Parker can enjoy this win. What, first of all, when you guys go down 7 nothing right away, what happens that allows you to be able to just stick with it and keep them out of the end zone the rest of the game? Uh, most of us have been in situations like that before. Uh, Coach Tone is to keep our composure. Uh, you know, just, just, just know the situation. Uh, there's a hopeful game to go. And just kept bad on it. You know, the end of the game. What's going through your mind there at the very end when Greg makes that pick off the tip ball? I, I can't even explain. Yeah, it was probably one of the greatest feelings of my life. Uh, it's definitely a great, a good feeling, and it's something you just can't describe. And uh, the play of the D line, it seemed like they really kind of took, stepped it up, especially in the second half. One guy I noticed, in particular, Trey Passat, just seemed like he was mauling the guys in front of him, allowing you to make plays. Yeah, that's huge. Uh, it makes our job easier, and we're thankful for having a good line. Uh, they're still improving, and uh, I'm 100% sure they're going to get better because they work hard every day in practice. Now what? Do you guys feel like you have to be able to do going forward here? Uh, just improve. Watch the tape. You know, we didn't play a perfect game. Uh, you know, just getting our reads and just trying to improve.